we are back with Miss Hillary, and we did two weeks ago. So we had you had to go out of town. So um, we are back. We did the seventh hour two weeks ago, and which is head and neck. And so, how have the last two weeks been? Um, they've been great. I don't want to ever go two weeks again because I just was like, wait, I want to come back in a week. You know, <laughs> take my mask down. Um, so I don't recommend going two weeks if you can avoid it. Um, but I have, I kept noticing continued cumulative benefit. So, um, this, this sense that in the beginning series of the series, I really like each week, like had key things that I could point back to. And this has been more of this natural sort of organic, like things just move better. I can't really point to anything. It's just sort of this general ease around movement that has started to integrate for lack of a better word um and after like directly after the last session i did i after uh, the le next couple days after the head and neck session i did sort of feel my head didn't ache or anything but i definitely felt like somebody had been <laughs> manipulating <Yes>. my head <laughs> and, like i could feel like oh parts of my skull like in in ways that i had never really noticed before um and I did notice a couple of times over the past two weeks, and I feel like it was probably maybe smack in the middle of the two weeks, so like not right after I had that session, but not like yesterday, somewhere in there. Um, I woke myself up grinding my teeth, and so I have known that I grind my teeth from my dentist, and I have braces, like orthodont, and my jaw was like in a misalignment. But I would, I didn't know it, yeah. and so we talked a lot about the fact that like something in me knew that I was doing that now, and I literally woke up to like the grinding sound, and so my body didn't let me stay asleep. It was like, no, 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 we don't do that anymore. Right. And, like woke me up from it. Abort so, mission. Abort mission. I, right. <laughs> I flagged it for you. Like, is that is that related? And of course, you were like, I think it's related because your body's not letting you do that anymore. Um, because of the work done on the jaw to like release that tension and stuff like that. So that was like a tangible. Um, and then just sort of that, again, that ease of movement. Um, I The story I was telling you, Nikki, was um, uh, helping a friend hang curtains in their loft apartment. So it's like the, you know, the windows are up here, the windowsill is there, the windows are really tall. And just sort of like springing up to like, from the standing position on the floor, like foot up on the windowsill, stand up on the windowsill, hang the curtains, step back down, just bend easily. And she, my friend was like, how are you doing all that? Like, you're not even like stretching or like grunting. You right, know, right. it was like just this easy flow to sort of move from the floor up to the ceiling and back down again. Um, and yeah. so much that, that your felt, friend noticed it. Yeah, she like, was like, you're just like everywhere. <laughs> like, how are you moving like that? So. That, that's been interesting to just kind of um, do it and observe it, Yeah. Um, but it's not conscious. Like yeah. It's like you're observing it after you've done it. You're like, oh, I just moved it like that. That was cool. Right. Um, versus like, let me intentionally move this way. It's just happening. Yeah. Um, that is, again, that cumulative um, effect, so. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Um, so for those of you, uh, so today is the first integration hour. So we've torn Hillary apart with the seven, uh, the first seven, and now we're going to start to put her back together. Um, so we're going to start with the lower girdle, which is the legs and hips, and, um, and it put those back together. And then next week we'll do arms and shoulders. And we'll talk more about that because um, it, it doesn't make sense until it does. Yeah. So we're just going to get started. <laughs> I believe you because that's been true all along. Right. <laughs> I always feel like a telemarketer. Like, you have to see it to believe it. But it's so fucking true. It's annoying. <laughs> it's true. It's true. I, and I hope this is helpful for folks to, like, hear it from, like, somebody who's going through it. So. Yes. No, I yeah. love it. I love it. So awesome. Let's get started. Okay. Yay.